And good evening. I'm going to say evening because it's evening here, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name's Fragnetic. This is my good mate, Devo. We're going to be casting this bad boy for you in a second. Um, and our match tonight looks like uh, Team Nordic and Team Belgium, Devo. Yeah, it is. Um, Nordic's a pretty new team, apparently. It's like an amalgamation of uh, some European countries, obviously. Not, not really sure which ones, though. <laughs> They're looking like Finland, mostly the Swedes, and uh, somebody from Norway. And um, it's pretty much the Scandinavian mixed team versus uh, Team Belgium, who've been around for a while. The only names I really recognize who stand out to me are, of course, uh, Smize and Kytos. So it'll be interesting to see how these guys go. Now, you can see on the screen in front of you, we've got uh, CTF on Turnpike and Kingdom TS tonight. Kingdom TS. Is that a, uh, is that a Belgium pick there, or is that a Nordic pick, Devo? I'm not sure. I'll have a look. I will figure it out. Um, elephant in the room here is that uh, us Australians, we're, um, I don't know how many people know this, but we're not tremendous CTF players. Um, bit of a running joke about our CTF abilities. What we do know, however, ladies and gentlemen, is uh, Urban Terror. So it's going to be a whole lot of volume and um, a whole lot of shouting, and we'll bring it to you live. Just getting in the server now. Now, there are some people among you who probably would have realized that um, we're not... This is a rebroadcast. I believe uh, Seven of Nine probably advertised that. Shout out to a good friend, Seven of Nine, who is uh, making this possible. It was quite a good game, and I'm sure you guys will be entertained. We uh, thought it deserved commentary. And ideally, we're going to try to commentate as many games as we can um, as the season goes on. However, the big problem right here, right now, is that we're actually short streamers. We need a couple more streamers. We've got Seven of Nine, who... Everybody knows has done a lot of hard work over the years, did a really good job last year, and has stepped out of the, the uh, limelight somewhat this year. We've also got, I think it's NSTAR who does a lot of the other casting, Devo? Yes. As yeah, well correct. as Nova. As well as Nova. Okay, so we've also got Nova, who is uh, currently missing presumed dead. If, <laughs> if you've heard from Nova, please let me know. He's got a video of another one that Devo and I did that we probably need to get uploaded. But um, look, I'm rambling a little bit. If you live in... Uh, North America or EU, and you can stream, then um, give us a call. Talk to Seven of Nine in IRC, and um, we'll see what we can do because the need is great and there are not many people who are stepping up. So, All right, we're underway here, Ed. We're underway here. Good push straight away from Saad. <laughs> Almost catches the nade. Good defensive nade there from G. Saad looking for the frag. Gets dropped down. Pretty solid defense coming out from both teams here. Zlatan stepping in, gets popped. Kytos able to get away with flag, two seconds remaining. Will be very slow, looking for the chase through mid here, but he safely made it to Metro, Devo. It's quite slow pushing through spawn. Going through mid, gets the flag. And the TK in time. Cheyenne holding pillars here. Taking stage dangerously close to Shans. <laughs> And that's two inside 50 seconds there. Look, very impressive start here for Team Belgium. Obviously that defense looking pretty solid right now. Nice push right up into mid-tracks here, looking to get the early pick. Counters the nade. <laughs> Code hangers. Uh, was that Saad there? Pretty intense stuff. That's another cap. Third one coming through, Devo. Spawn's just in time. Slatten trying to push through mid here. Good contest Kytos there, happening in stage three, Kytos Kytos just in time, yeah, very oh, and flanked. Still gets Kate out in time though, so a good run there. Smy's dying early, the team is coming in in time, and we're going to see, uh, ooh, Cheyenne out just in time there. So we've got a 4v5 happening, is that a GTV glitch? Am I seeing that? Oh, uh, that's what I'm seeing. Okay, cool. Contest in station. Smice is down. Nordic pushing up very fast. Hmm. Yeah, the, uh, the flag toss there. Nice down. That just TK just Belgium in here. time. Solid defense here from Belgium, Devo, quite early on. Looking like an impressive 3-0 so far. 
obviously playing the easier side. Re <laughs> Reflex gets one, looking to get two. Got four seconds to go here, opting not to kill him, instead bleeds out. Was that a misplay there? Oh, I think that was a good play. Hmm. Aggression here from Kaitos, dodging the nade. That's one, that's two, being forced back. Four seconds to go, needs to hit the shot. Boost his teammate through, but will likely die full here. Yeah, that's the flank again, Out Davo. Long. Good action here from Shan. Calls out for the TK, gets that. Zabeast, aka Zizu, doing his thing in station, looking to contest this early on the 12 second mark. Dodging nades, throws another one in. Big fight at the station. Rovis is going to say, nope, see ya mate, I'll just hang back here. Good trade. Clever the nade there from Rovis, not going to catch anybody, perhaps a tad early. Not much aggression here from station. The Belgians. And just in time, Katos 3, but 3 seconds to go. He's been taken by Viking, one comes through mid, Smyce tries to shut him down, looking for the shot in mid. Will not Runs out of stem. Safely away, Devo. Should be looking to TK there. Oh, that's a bit of a misplay right there. Slight misplay. Will, will regret that. Gets smacked in mid there, straight away. Reflex, good defense. And Smyze obviously pushed up. Gonna move across and flank the flank there. He's got three seconds to do it. He's shut down. Another 5v5 round coming in. Aggressive push here from the Nords. Reflex shutting him down. Not much health remaining. Gets the TK and his teammate. Not a whole lot of health here. Ready for the Zlatan push, but he is a bit slow. Sees five blue players. Oh, See you later. <laughs> That's what we call in Team Australia doing a howler, ladies and gentlemen. Belgium looking so pretty just comfortable at this point. In there. Lucky to get that TK, just in time. Kytos comes screaming in, sees one van, gets the shot off, looking for the guy on flag. One hit, two hit, three hits, gets it! <laughs> and that flank from behind. It's taken down by Zabeast. Zabeast pushing That's Metro. well. Oh, bit of a misnade there. Unlucky there. Rob's a bit unfortunate there, being taken down. Reflex under some pressure here on flag. Gets two. <laughs> well done, Reflex. Impressive play coming out from Reflex here. Looking to get the... Uh, that's not quite a spawn trap. Just K'ing out <laughs> the round. And flags are reset. Gonna see another 5v5 push there. Reflex still sitting in pillars. Two pushing him. Ah, too strong. Not strong enough there. The Nord's getting the flag grab. Interestingly enough, be chased through pillars, but flanks have been traded here. Flag Good return. Slatten's taken down. And the TK's coming in as well. Three-one, not quite as comfortable as three-zero, David. No, they're looking a lot better uh, as time goes on. Obviously the Nords have quite a uh, strong roster here, um, a lot of these plays have been around for a while. Start in a good position to get two here, we'll let them go past, obviously making the call here. And three on one remaining here, looking for the TK, will get it, oh. is that late? No he won't, that's late. Bad luck, Kytos here with Kytos the best possible chances. Oh, no support. I think that was a case of strong E there, just well read. That's what you gotta do when you're a man down. On board with Reflex. Bit of a bit of, uh, of a powerhouse in this first half, Reflex. Uh, shutting down a lot of caps. He's done well. Zlatan taking mid here. Seems to have a fairly good run in mid. Sard coming all the way through the station. Reflex from behind. Unlike, unlucky there not to get away with the flag again. Strong defense from Belgium. Reflex here in a good position, gets one! Ups the grab. Or does he? And Belgium is completely down at the moment.
Very impressive by the Nords there to get that flag out. Reflex so close there. Slatan comes out of mid right on time. Cheyenne just smacks him in the face there. Here comes the next attacking phase. He hits one, hits Viking two. Gets two. Should be Four an easy grab remaining. This looks very much like 3 all here, Deva. And Smizer's taken down long. <laughs> Things just starting to unravel here for Belgium. Oh, well time nade there. That's one of the things you see, um, uh, seeing a lot of composure here from the uh, Nords. Take three quick caps and bring themselves back. Vikings in the action, he gets one, gets dropped, unfortunately. Looking to be a contender for a grab there. Uh, we'll see a reset, and this will be playing right into the hands of the Nords, so they'll be content to keep this scoreline drawn, playing on the hard side. Viking again with the grab. They've been leaning very heavily on reflex, and um, there's only so much the man can take, it seems. Rocket in the mid here, looking to contest. Viking. Only one up. Latan <laughs> gets one. Goes for the backstab there. Unfortunately, Kotos going to be out full, most likely. Yes, there we go. Zizu just cleaning him up. Things seem to have slowed down here slightly. Devo. It's a beast trying to get back into Metro. Gets one. Taken down by Kytos. Two as well. Good defense hit by Slatten. Kytos here looking to be in a good position. Pushing up just on the tracks here. Feeling very comfortable. Takes an early headshot, unfortunately. It comes flying around with the Deagle. Cheyenne kindly enough tags up one, tags up two. Three seconds remaining in this round and the Nords will look to TK out here. <laughs> that, that was quite well done. <laughs> that was good timing. That's, um, that's why we watch these streams, over. Picked up a free tip there. Belgian defence looking solid. A few concerns about the Belgian defence. Seem to be getting cleaned up from mid a lot, which is what you, I suppose, is what you expect, but... Um, the Nords doing a really good job of defending this. Very happy to keep it to three all, and that'll be the first half. Thank you very much. What do you make of that, David? Oh, it was an interesting first half, uh, especially uh, being tied on the uh, on the more difficult side. Um, could be in for a good second half here. Mm, if I was Belgium, I'd be a bit nervous at this. Uh, so we'll go right ahead and jump into the second half of this CTF match. Uh, Looks just like it. First, first want to uh, throw a shout out to uh, Biddle, who's doing the GTV at the moment. Doing a good job. Old mate Biddle, busy. Oh, we're underway. Strong defense here from the Nords, good TK. Comes out, just gets it in time. Rover's patting those nades out. We'll defend tracks. Big ask here for Belgium to get through. There's the flank from mid. <laughs> With key to the M4 to drop there, there, there. Smiles just in time to grab this. Not much health. We'll get back around the corner and you can expect... <laughs> Drops the, the flag, flag. accident. <laughs> it's taken down by the beast. That has not gone well. Reflex here already doing a good job. Will... Yeah. We'll, we'll survive that. It's done well. Satan here in mid. <laughs> Looking to attack, gets the pick, not up to shoot at the guy on top of Forklift. Uh, there's not much you can do with that time frame anyways. Uh, no, it's probably Satan here playing a good game mid. A lot of pressure being applied in pillars here. Hmm. That is one of the important battles. Nobody likes getting shot repeatedly from spawn. <laughs> The beast here, Chance well, here for the Shuts that attack down. 
That was an eSports TK there, I'm not sure how many of you caught that. <laughs> That's pretty good. Reflex, quite aggressive defense there. Zlatan looking to go through mid. Not sure where his opposite number is. There, he found him. There we go. 14 seconds, unfortunately. Not much health. Most likely going to be... Oh, still getting two shots. Three shots with it. That is the power of the league. Still scoreless there, though. Yeah. Jay in here, padding out the nades. Steps into mid, into reception, gets double headshots. See you later. Viking looking to grab, got six seconds. The one hit, two hits, grabs it. Should be away with the flag here. Gets leg. Brilliant shot by Viking there. Uh, and this will be slow going. Here comes the tactical timeout. Is it a tactical timeout, Tepo? I'd, I'd say so, yes. Uh, it's still it's looking pretty two and a half tactical. minutes through. Yes. Uh, also something to mention, um, the the bug with the wave spawn, uh, wave spawn timers is still unfixed at the moment, but i um, been told by good mate Seven that... Sevo. Um, Sevo. That Frozen Sands has an update, has an imminent update, uh, ready for us to patch this up. Uh, so we should be good to go any day now. Uh, finally fix this dreadful bud. Bud. The pelk. <laughs> we love what you do, guys. Um... <laughs> Not gonna miss, yeah. <laughs> having to, having to, remember the old days of having to reload everything. Hang on, unplug it, wait, plug it back in, wait, do the reload. Oh, is it, is it bugged? Hang on, we'll just test. Oh, yeah, not gonna miss that. So, uh, that's good stuff. Interesting that we're still scoreless here, because if you recall in the other half, Belgium came out with uh, three really, really quick caps there. It's probably just figuring out exactly how they want to attack. Now it's their turn to. I mean, it's their game to win, isn't it? Oh, and I just Absolutely. got booted. Coming oh, back. Okay. Keep, just, just tell the people what they need to hear, Devo. Hang on. Hang <laughs> well, on. Well, the game's being resumed right now, so you should be back in time. <laughs> Hopefully. If there's a time to get dropped, it's right now. Vikings obviously are going to be taken down. See some action in Metro from the death cam there. Viking, if I push in, be a bad idea. Gets taken down. Belgium's only two remaining. One remaining. Chance for the Nords. See what they can do. Could see our first cap here, Ed. Oh, and he's back! Ed's back, ladies and gentlemen. He's <laughs> back in the server. What have I missed? Oh, here we go. Good defense from Viking here on Jeep. Turns, gets the second. Looking at TK, his teammate, a little too eager there. And Davo, as you said, that is the first cap. Nord's in a comfortable position now on the easier side. Still just one cap ahead, though. We'll see what they do. Oh. <laughs> that was a bit unfortunate that, uh, there. Esports e flick there. Esports fail. The beast probably, yeah. Not be so happy about that. Being very defensive at the moment. Four guys still been back parking. Oh well, that's a lot true. Being one cap off us. Two guys been put out in reception. Good work there by Shan. Who all to get to? Zlatan still gets away with the flag and cleans up Shan. Looking like it's all clear here. We're gonna need. We'll probably get Norky, no, no, Viking watching mid here. Falls back to look for the flag. Will he get it in time? Brilliant defense there by Rocket. Unfortunately, not respawning in time to stop that next flag. Just grabbing that, making short work of that, and the Nord's now 2 0 up. Just Good defense there by Kratos. Yeah, yeah, falls back. Done. 
Unfortunately, good defense is not going to win this game for Belgium. Mikey comes flying in. That's the double, double headshot. That's what, you, that's what the people like to see. That's the second frag. Exciting stuff from Viking. Sard in with the TK. Looks to fall back. And I believe that's... Oh, no. Yep, that's all dead for Belgium. So having a clear run here. Good mid hold as well. And there's another the timeout. Red. Yeah, by Belgium. Might, might call that a rage timeout, Davo. Another tactical timeout. It's just it's just not working for them. They're going to have to change something. A bit of banter happening as well. That's what you like. That is the spirit of Nations Cup, ladies and gentlemen. That's We like to encourage that around here. Unless it's Swifty, that guy needs to unbind chat. It's becoming a problem. Not that he plays very many matches. <laughs> Aha, uh -huh. and Devo, um, this might be your little uh, respawn timer section. Are you seeing this? <laughs> uh. Bit of friendly debate about uh, which is the game that we should be playing instead of this one. I see CSGO coming out. Uh, StarCraft 2 is definitely a popular choice. Definitely yeah. not CS. Definitely oh, not yeah, LOL okay. either. If anybody likes CS and would like to win some CS games, definitely play with Devo. Um, he's got a really low rank, and you can just tell him what to do, and he shoots people. Um, it doesn't like the game all that much, though. It is too slow for him. Um, Devo also isn't very good at clicking on heads, so um, yeah, it's, it's working against him. But we're seeing the timeout uh, coming back. Viking attacking. But there's a 2v1 there. Flag capture time, 94 seconds. Very quick there by Saad Devo. Nord's be feeling very comfortable here with a 3 0. Viking are looking to help Reflex out here with a tactical TK. No, there we go. Gets him down full. Hits the second one. Very well played with the timer there. Looking to cap back through mid, perhaps. Fighting everybody, that's the third guy he gets. Sun <laughs> will come flying out to uh, to help his teammate, but um, too little. Doesn't quite do it. Viking not to be stopped, goes straight for the flag attack, gets that. Was that a double headshot there? Looks like it. Doing his very best to TK early. And the flag is already gone. That flag's not in a great place there, is it, David? Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, did you see? Did you, did you not see that? It's brilliant flag defense. Let's carry it out in front of Jeep there, and um, Belgium just uh, let it be. Like here at the reception, helping out with mid control. <laughs> There's where it was. Did you catch it that time? <laughs> yes. And yeah, the Nords will make it away back to the middle. Viking just <laughs> just doing the uh, tribes two body block there. And that'll be 4-0 for the North Cap. Need some digger nice to some make Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> Amazed that he got so far there, Devo. You see that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> to no avail. <laughs> so close, so close, and that will leave a bad taste in your mouth. Slatan, running backwards, placing those nades, gets the 60. And that's the next flag. This is um, very quickly becoming an unwinnable match here for Belgium. Five caps is a bit of an ask with only uh, two and a half minutes remaining. I wonder what Al would do in this situation. Probably blame start me. yelling. Yeah, well, yeah. There is yeah, that. That's definitely what would happen. <laughs> you are the whipping boy of the team, David. Slatan here opening up mid doors. Feeling pretty confident here. Comes flying round and eventually gets a kill. Bit of a service stutter there. Will he go to window or is he waiting? No, waiting for the trap. He's mid again. Ah, uh, not beaten there. And that flag's got away. That'll be 6 0. And with two minutes to go, that is quite an ask. Um, Belgium, probably the best thing they can do at the moment is just pick themselves up. Um, just make sure their shot is on for a chance at the second map. Yeah. Uh, which will be Kingdom TS. Mm. King is great map, absolutely brilliant map. Very tactical map, quite a fast map. A lot of people don't realize that about Kingdom. Slatan with the flick, hits up Smize there. 
Solid defense again from the Nords. This is doing a very good job. Zizu and Rovis duo, quite formidable. They've got matching armbands, because they're mates. You see that, Devo? You seeing that? Uh, I did. Slap has been dominating mid this half. Dominating mid? Yeah. No, nobody's really getting past. That's that's the big of um just just the 1v1. Like if you're not if you're not winning it, then um it's looking bad. Everybody else has to watch behind. You can't watch directly in front of you, and it gets pretty tough pretty quick, and that's what we're seeing here. Belgium start getting away with the flag again. Liking with uh, just a solid burst there, forcing his forcing his opponent behind the fan. Oh! Really a shot again by Reflex there. This guy's quite a player. Effectively just renders Viking useless there. Still strong defense from the Nords here. Just managing to bleed down the timer. And really at this point, it's just it's just stat padding. Interested to see what Jim uh, can bring in map 2. Yeah, it, it'll be difficult to, to pick themselves up, keep the aim warm and whatnot, but uh, they've just got to let, let it go, you know, it's in the past. GG's being called. That's true. Uh, David that and was, I are uh, no stranger to getting thrashed at CTF, so um, we know a bit about picking ourselves up afterwards, don't we David? Yeah, just use it as aim warm-up, really. Aim warm-up, mate. It's just an aim warm-up, mate. Too easy. See you in Austria. <laughs> That's the only way to do it, man. Oh, well played there by the Nords. Um, very impressive defense from uh, Sisu and Rovis. And from Reflex as well. Uh, Ed, are you ready to go straight into the next map? Mate, I'm, I'm always ready, dude. Let's just top frag this. Do it. Alright, so Kingdom TS, uh, what do you expect coming into this? I expect to just load up the map real quick. Hang on, sorry. You just keep the people busy, Devo. I'll be there in a sec. Oh, we're straight in. And we are straight in. Okay, well, um, let's start. Quite a tactical map. Three main lanes here, um, and some interesting crossfires. I'd say there's a strong half and a weak half. Revis here, that crouch burst! Somebody's been playing CSGO! Interesting 3 on 3 happening at the fountain. Brainless, last man up. Had a bit of a lineup change here. Uh, oh, Brainless yeah, of is taken out, unfortunately. GTV. Sorry, I'm back now. And we're running here. Zizu. Yeah, Nate's go flying at Bo there. Oh, whew, very lucky it's to stay alive light. after catching that one up. You gotta learn that, Devo. Get your whiteboard out. <laughs> <laughs> falling back here looking for the mid under Tavern. There's Latan here with the first pick on Kaitos. That's unfortunate for Belgium. Doing very well to take the first round. Oh, but the counter pick from Reflex. That uh, SR8, which I've done very well not to call an AWP, hanging out at uh, Chapel here. Being dangerous. Brave, brave man there. RKQ jumping over. Looking for the medic. Now, um, what do you do here, Belgium? We've got the stack happening up in Courtyard, which means that we've got grass, which is pretty open. Belgium don't know that yet, or they would have taken advantage of it. Be interested to see where they are. Rovers looking for a scope for his scope. Yeah, Belgium just keeping slowly out to grass here, and it looks like they're going to meet. Yeah, there we go. Shot there coming out from Zizu. Now the tricky thing about GTV is knowing exactly how many people are actually dead because it's not refreshing for me. I believe we're sitting in a 3v3, which means that this push here from Zizu could be the round. Looking to met up, hits one, gets dropped. RKQ looks to move in and equalize, and there we go. Brilliant round there from the Nords. Obviously, the, that's the power of the first pick there, Devo. Rovis has an interesting position here. Hmm. This is a beast being taken down first though. Slatten also. Bit of fight here from the Belgians. 
Only one remaining for the Nords. Reflex pushing through Chapel. Brainless will be taken down. Yeah, well done there. Sick double from Shan. Sitting on 4-1 to one currently. And pretty standard. We're looking like we've got Scope for Scope happening over at Courtyard, which would be an interesting battle to watch. To Rocket here, a brave man standing up in mid. Lucky not to get hit by a nade. Falls back for the med here. We've got three stacked currently in Courtyard for Belgium. There's another pick from Zlatan, doing well with the nades here. Zizou does well to get a second one. And a bit of trouble here for Belgium. Grass is completely clear. Brainless will be calling this here. A bit far away. A bit far away, yeah. Good UMP headshot there. UMP always one of those weapons. You're never confident hitting with it. It's brilliant when it pays off. It's the sneaky med going out in bow here. Thoughts with the luxury of having more players alive in the game. However, they are down around, so they'll be looking to group up here. They've still got three minutes remaining. Zizou does well to check Fountain here. It's unlikely that the Belgians will be pushing, though, with the man disadvantage and the round advantage. So we'll see what they do. They need to group up and go for a walk here. And no sounds yet. Zizou contemplating looking cool here. Needs to check all the angles. Sees one. It's the headshot. This should be the round. Zizou gets one. We'll get the second one as well. That's that's um that's greedy. Is what that is, Demo. <laughs> that was was just unfortunate timing there on Belgium's half. Mm. You get the feeling that they um would would have liked to see a bit more composure there from Belgium. Unfortunate that they run straight through, making a lot of noise. Over to you, Devo. Risky nade peeking the uh, scope there. Three guys in chapel, though. This is your bad overconfident there, would you say? <laughs> Mate, I'm just chucking the nade. I'm going. I'm just, I'm going. Back me up, boys. <laughs> Early nades here going out from Smyers. And this is the bow battle. Popping out straight away. <laughs> Smyers unlucky not to hit there. Um, needs to be a little bit sharper. And the first pick, of course, going against Belgium here. Still with a round advantage. We'll need, we'll need to counter pick here. We'll see what we'll see what the Nords decide to do. Playing on the weaker half here with the numerical advantage. Belgium just content to sit and wait in chapel here. A bit of a stack. However, the Nords do have. They know this is happening. They've got mid. So they've got a flank happening around at spawn. Brainless watching this with a scope. We'll know that they've got all these players alive in chapel. Brainless doing a good job. Not. Oh no! Here we go. <laughs> Brainless is going in. UMP and does well to catch Smize. Uh, reflex looking the wrong way. So that's a good rush. That is the danger of um, grouping up there. Devo. Finally get to see the scope battle over here at Courtyard. Mm. Not much action though. A lot of action over at Grass though by the sounds of things. RKQ being taken down first. Get the equalise, but Belgium too strong this round. Brainless knows there's a guy in the oh. Gets one. Dies to Katos. Yeah, great round there from um, Belgium. Just very dominant through Bowen Library here. We'll see what Katos can do here. Throwing that deep nade, perhaps too deep. Bout interesting nade there into top mid. Don't think he's going to catch anybody there, though. Only a madman would be up that close. Does well here to watch under bottom mid. Zizu gets the first frag, unfortunately. Smyre's going down. Katos to equalize. We're looking like a 4 on 3 currently, 4 on 2. The battle is happening in library. Kytos to finish this guy off, and will he go through the power D? The power D! The Deagle! <laughs> Going for the Deagle finish is unlucky not to get that last one there, and a great round from Belgium putting them two up, Devo. Kytos again with the pre nades in mid. Smythe again being taken down at bow early. Gets the equalizer though. Brainless bleeding out. Only one alive for Belgium. Nordic metting up here in bow. Probably get the kill. 
Uh, unfortunately, and the Nord's tending to put a few guys in bow quite early in the round, which is nade bait, is what that is. So, um, yeah, lucky to get away with that round, really. We've got two guys standing on grass. I, I question this decision here from Sisu, who needs to fall back, throwing that nade, going back for the med with Rovis. Whatever Zizu's doing, though, it, clearly it's working. He's 12 7 up. And we're looking at more of a standard play here by the Nords. Kills exchanged over on grass. More on four here. The Nords on the weaker half of the map as well. Expect Belgium to do something here to try to solidify their lead, but the push comes through courtyard. One falls, two falls. We've got Slatan very nearly going down as well. Quick flank here. Unable to land the hits there, Shane. Oh, he'll be regretting that. And it's very quickly starting to look like, there it is, another Nordic round. Five all. Early contest over mid there, that's an aggressive nade. It's pretty close to Zlatan, who's lucky to be alive. Gets gone through mid, counter pick by Sisu. Is <laughs> Sisu goes down to Kytos. Kytos here going straight through mid. Probably the call has gone out here. We've got to wonder why Rovis is choosing to mid right there. Lucky to get that kill. And he's the last guy standing. Gets the second one, gets picked off. Brilliant, aggressive round there by Belgium. That's exactly what you want to see after the score gets tied up again. Some uh, nerd nades going there into mid. Good to see those taken down. That's what you want to see. Ah, oh, brainless, unfortunately, being flanked there. Three all. Action going down on grass. See pushy from Nordic. I have the man advantage. Probably going to want to get this round uh, over and done with as quickly as possible. Mm, be interested to see where our last Belgian is hiding here. Obviously it's in his best interest to make this round last as long as possible. Taking down Robus, not sure where. Bow maybe. Yeah, yeah unlucky there. Smize there. Good to see a close game here, Dave. We've got a got six all happening. Um, the Belgians, though they might have uh, been toppled in CTF, still bringing it in TS. Oh, <laughs> brilliant nade there by RK. Uh, Zizu overzealous, steps in his own nade. Brandless, this is putting the Nords up 4 to 2 currently. Contest in library is won by Zlatan. Taking the time to med up here. Dangerous position still. Without knowing for sure where the Belgians are. Likely will. There, that's exactly what we're talking about. Good flick there by RKQ to equalize. Blue team wins. And Katos and... taken down in bow. There you go. Yeah, if you've got the audacity to med in library, uh, you will most likely be punished. Uh, Nord's likely to get, um, lucky to get away with that. See a group up here in courtyard, and they're pushing through to chapel. Strong rush. Catch brainless. Although the Nordics equalize. Vulnerable to a flank here. Right on time. Rocket's very low. And he's taken down. Yeah, unfortunately he just grouped up there. Got the entry frag and then just kind of stagnated. Got our bottled in there. It's not exactly what you want to see. This is great for this early nade into bow. Sees the laser, will fall back. We've got two hanging out in bow. Zizu, tent to take him on, says thank you very much. Gets the quick med. <laughs> Looking out for the flank. And it is just everybody is having a go at bow right now. Reflex pushing up through courtyard. Looking to get the flank. Possibly shoot across the grass. Will need to move quickly here if he's to keep this round. Gets one! Yes, well done. Now it's a 1v1. A little Saw bit the last man. Reflex. Oh. The Rovers with the flank through library. Yeah. Reflex probably a little bit slow there on the flank, wouldn't you agree? Yeah. This is the first time we've seen a lead of three rounds. Well. 
Hopefully the Belgians will be able to pick themselves up. And as I say that, the first frag going out to JN. Very missing a guy there in foul. Yeah. Revis, everybody's favourite loudmouth, finally gets the kill. Um, that took a little too long. And we'll be calling frantically for a med here. Shane in a 1v3, now a 1v2. And Revis with not much... Oh! <laughs> Brilliant. I'll put that down to GTV. Brilliant round there by Shane. Are you getting that? It's showing like five people alive when it's really two? Yes. <laughs> One name Reflex demo. being taken down in courtyard. So... Rovus not here in the command to his left. No. Nordic still picks up the round. Stretches the lead back to three. No problems getting around there, though. Interesting play on Garden. I don't think I've ever seen that work, just four guys standing in Garden. I think if we were to try that, one nade would just take us all out. Well, it would, yeah. Interesting hold at bottom mid here by Rovis. You seeing this? I don't know how practical that is, but whew, that was lucky. Very lucky close, not nade. To get, yeah. Two frags going out here. Rovis looking to equalize. Quite as sharp as you should be here, taking another pop through dark room. Reflex with the flight gets one. Should put some good shots on Rovis here, who has been a bit subpar recently. Rocket here looking to go. clean up this kill, yeah. Bit of medkit swapping happening. Rocket too eager, not nailing those shots. Needs to be waiting for his teammate in situations like that. Sometimes strange things happen to your brain when you're on six skills, though, so. Okay, Q, obviously. <laughs> oh, that's a Shannon level play right there by OKQ. Okay, and now he can probably and see Mets him to run away, yeah. Brilliant. Definitely Brilliant. Shannon. Definitely a Shannon Shannon level play there. The only difference is these guys are playing on quite reasonable pinks. And no throwing knives. <laughs> RKQ with all the time in the world here, three rounds up. Knows his opponent is on less than half health. We'll be content to just sit here and twiddle his thumbs for two and a half minutes. Best case scenario. Do you think this is a slash kill moment? It's It's got to be. He's got to check pub. Yes. Oh, very tense. RKQ delivers. That's It's getting close to a slash kill moment, David. You're right. With five minutes remaining, you don't really have the luxury of time. You're not allowed to waste time in that sort of situation. Over to you, David. Guy in mid. Three. Oh. And Belgians down, only two players remaining. Nords have grouped up in Fountain. Mm. Again, they won't be wanting to end their rounds. Another one of these situations, yeah. Smart play here from the Nords. What do you do if you're Belgium here? You really just have to go for it, don't you? You do. Um, wasting time is obviously not going to do any good. Uh, the round advantage is now four. Might as well have some idea that they're here. Checking corners. Making a lot of noise. Not moving in with his teammate. No, Rocket in the, in the wrong place again. <laughs> and that's the three-way crossfire. Oh, yeah, there's no way that was going to work, unfortunately. The Nord's looking like having this one as well. They were looking like a 2-0 at the moment. Five up. There's good defensive nades here happening from RKQ. He's heard a call go out. Smize gets Latan. <laughs> Nord, <laughs> RKQ getting a little bit um, a little bit nervous there. Puts a shot onto Brainless. He's convinced there's somebody mid. He's done well. He has missed that shot though. You'd think that was an easy burst. Comes flying around the corner. Yeah, has not, has not played that very well at all. And that's a great round there from Belgium. Just being aggressive through the mid. That's what you like to see. Yeah, Belgium just really need to, to rush these last few rounds, try and get on the board. Mm. And that's exactly what we're seeing. Cheyenne being taken very low. Two being mopped up there by RKQ, very well done. And a third Full being taken down. Oh, and you've seen this play before, haven't you? Fountain. Yeah. And Another great round there. Flawless of the match, if I'm not mistaken. 
Yeah, I think you're right on that one. Uh, Kingdom being a very... I, I did earlier say that this is a quick map, however, it's very easy to punish a team rushing on Kingdom. Makes it difficult. Very tactical map, and you often see frags and counter frags, like you just saw in Bow there, but 3-1 up from Belgium here, you'd think this would be around. The last Nordic player, of course, just... <laughs> doing his best Attempting to run, to run away. <laughs> Attempting to run away right into the mass of uh, enemies has not gone so well. And yet another round for Belgium. This is getting pretty tight here, Deva. Rocket being taken down by an early nade. Belgium still have to push in though. Three men, uh, two men down. Taking up positions in the spawn. That is telling, isn't it? The Nords here deliberately slowing things down. The Belgians are a little too aggressive. Uh, not checking themselves before they wreck themselves. Um, straight through garden there. Nords with the luxury of time once again. That's an interesting nade, Devon. Bit of a pop HE there. Unlucky, back's turned there from Kaitos. That's one of the most dangerous positions in the game. However, Belgium with 2-1 up. Oh, finished out. off by Rocket. Still four rounds away. Still down by four. I don't think it's possible. No, it's certainly getting very difficult here. I really think that the GG's went flying probably about three minutes ago, but good spirit here from the Belgians. Obviously haven't given it away. Unfortunate to peak that. Uh, not a great run through mid there by Reflex. I think things are starting to unravel here for Belgium. Yeah. Rocket really in the wrong position. Two early nades. That's uh, how you stop the rush. Oh, Belgium's done very well to come through this, though. Fantastically well. <laughs> oh, I was Timing very lucky. There. Thought he killed him. Obviously, kill sounds not engaged. Um, nothing like hearing those gongs go off. Mice here playing aggressively. I don't know if aggressively through bow is the way to do this. However, easy nade bait. That's well RKQ. To RKQ. Yeah. Rocket here, too much trigger, lucky to get the and not flick under Brainless. And you'd think the Nords would just time out here, and this will be a good game. Comes out from Reflex. Um, and that'll be the map there for the Nords. What a fight there by Belgium. It was very interesting. Um, you know, only only really going either way towards towards the end in the last five so minutes. Could have gone either way. Mm. And especially, I mean, if you were to take that second map and think of it in, in like, divide it in half, um, first half of the first half of a very close Belgium even looking to be in front at some points, and then unlucky to just, just some unconventional plays there, getting caught out in garden a few times. Um, but obviously, the Nord's a little bit too strong in the end. Uh, shout out to Zizu, aka Z Beast. I am going to make him an honorary member of Banger Clan, Z Banger. Um, for not only running PW Ninja and getting all this stuff um, happening, but uh, playing a good game as well. Looking to be on top of all those scoreboards there. And um, yeah, probably my vote for player of the match currently, Devo. Yeah, I agree. Although, um, yeah, no, actually, I'd, I'd agree. I've got nothing else to say, really. Have you got seven um, nine whispering in your ear about UZ League matches? Yes. Uh, so <laughs> to, to all the teams in the UZ matches, uh, you have to schedule match your matches before Sunday. Uh, and uh, schedule your cards. matches. Don't run around without your cardigan on. You'll catch a cold. I think everybody got that. I think so. Uh, and uh, this this demo and shoutcast will be uploaded uh, tomorrow for us, but uh, uh, later on today for you Europeans. Mm. Uh, and um, Ed, what would you say about uh, Belgium going into their, ne their next match against India uh, this week, actually? Oh, I'd be keen to watch that. Always interested to see what India can put up. Um, have they already played the US? They did. Yes, they have. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, USA taking that match 2-0. You know, it's, it's interesting. It's India's, uh, obviously, their first time in Nations Cup, a new team. Mm -hmm. uh, I, think, I think anything, you know, anything they take away from these matches is, is going to be a plus for them. 
uh, team building and whatnot. But um, I think it could be an interesting match. <laughs> and I've just um, I've had the misfortune of uh, tabbing. I'm um, having <laughs> having a look at the uh, feedback from the community here. Um, shout out to old mate Howler underscore AU and uh, as mate. Um, <laughs> Uh, a lot of fun. Um, probably, probably Doodle Touch doing his worst. Um, <laughs> like his, sorry, I've, I've lost the plot here reading this chat. I don't know how these guys, these streamers, manage to like read the chat and play the game at the same time. Because this is just, um, this has thoroughly derailed me, Devo. I think it might, I might just quit while I'm ahead. Um, Oh yeah, one more time. If you can possibly stream, if you've got a computer that can run it and you don't live in Australia, um, talk to Seven of Nine on IRC. Obviously love to get um, more of these matches up and give them the love and attention that they deserve. Shout out to old mate Aussie Dan for as well, because I just cannot ignore that man. Um, it's, been a, it's been a pleasure, Devo. Look forward to uh, doing this also, again. Also, um... People, you need to uh, like the the UZ page on Twitch TV or whatever it is uh, Seven normally says, but also people to turn off your ad blockers and because uh, the money, the revenue raised, really does go to Seven of Nine <laughs> to uh, advance the <laughs> software. And I can't That's imagine right. what uh, Haller is saying. Please right donate. Now. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to. You don't want to look at it, man. But look, Hallett, you're derailing this. That's an important message, guys. If you could turn off ad blocker, that'd be fantastic. Um, <laughs> Every little bit counts. You got anything else, David? No, I don't. We're done here. It's been fun. And I'll catch you, Burnheads, later. Peace.